All right, so this direct message says, Sylvester, I wanna ask you something. When someone says that she's losing herself, she's losing her identity by being with you, how do you take that? I mean, first, I can respect that. I mean, I can respect that because I believe in free will. So I believe that people have the right to do whatever they feel is gonna be necessary, you know, to survive, to live, to have an abundant life. And if you feel like, if you feel like I'm holding you back, that's something I would, personally, I would wanna know that. If I'm holding back someone in a relationship or a friendship, I would wanna know that, you know, because what is it that I'm doing? You know, maybe it's, it could be my mindset, my behavior. It could be my lack of drive, my lack of ambition. Maybe I'm, I'm too, too overpowering or I'm too opinionate, you know, just maybe too much of something. I would want that personally, I would want the information. I would want to know, I would, I would say, okay, so, you know, you, you're losing yourself. What, what does that mean? Like, tell me more about what that means to you, you know, because I want, I want to understand it. Personally, I wouldn't try to attack the person and like, what you mean you losing your, you know, I would never do that. I would, I would ask questions like, you're losing yourself? What do you, like, what do you mean? Uh, how long have you been feeling this way? Have you tried to talk to me about this before? Is this like, where are you at with it? Do you just want to just go our separate ways? Or are you looking for some type of, of change? You know, how can I help you with that? Are there conversations we need to have about your goals, about, you know, where you want to go in life? Is it because I'm I've, I'm successful and I'm ahead of your curve and you're kind of below me, so it's like some comparison and some envy, or is it you're way super successful and I'm just like way down here and I'm holding you back? Personally, I would want I would want more questions so I could understand one the psychology of what this person is thinking, but then two so I could understand the picture of our relationship. Now that's just me. That's just the way I would approach it. You know, everyone's going to deal with it the way they want.